Snyder's 50-50 Burgers by Design, Herm. Mitch! Mitch in San Diego, congratulations. You will enjoy the election burger. The last three NBA winners, Heat, Mavs, Lakers. That's right. And they all play tonight on opening night of the NBA. You know what is also coming up uh, tonight at Tony Gwynn Stadium? This is really cool. And we've got uh, Mark Martinez, assistant baseball coach at SDSU, on the line. It's the annual Halloween baseball game uh, featuring all the players and coaches in costume. Coach, how you doing? Great. How are you guys doing today? Uh, we're doing great, Coach. Uh, tell us a little bit about, about tonight's festivities. This is, sounds like a crazy, wild event. Well, this is our third time that we've done this, and uh, we can't take uh, credit for the idea. We stole the idea from UC Irvine and their group up there, and I have a good friend of uh, mine, Pat Shine, and, uh, one of the assistant coaches up there, and... Uh, we kind of stole it from him. It's a really neat event. It's a lot of fun. You know, we invite all the kids to come out in costume, and we do pass out candy, so it's a, a precursor to Halloween. So if they want to get a jump start on their candy bag, um, come down to Tony Gwynn Stadium tonight, and uh, our players will be running through the stands uh, giving out candy uh, between innings. Give us a little preview of what's coming. I know we're still a, a couple of months away from the official start of practice, but uh, what, what do we got coming on Aztec Baseball this season? Well, you know, we got a we got a nice group coming back. Um, you know, we have a very veteran team. You know, a lot, you know, we're kind of out of excuses. You know, in the past we've had a lot of good talent, but a lot of young kids playing, and and now we're very strong through the middle. We probably have uh, four of the best catchers in the country, and and Brad Hanel and Jake Romanski and C.J. Saylor and Sebi Zavala. So one of those guys is going to catch. We're very fortunate to have those guys. That we're strong through the middle pitching and. Uh, Evan Potter and Tim Zier up the middle. Um, uh, both of those guys are juniors. Um, we do have, uh, we moved Greg Allen from right field to center field. He's a sophomore, uh, you know, potential All American, um, uh, only because our uh, normal starting center fielder, Spencer Thornton, had to undergo uh, Tommy John surgery. So, we're very, we're looking forward to you know a, a good group coming out an experienced group uh, guys that know how to play and and uh, we added some really good uh, recruits this year so we're very excited about uh, the prospects coming up this spring. Mark, tonight's event gets underway at six o'clock. You guys are going to play five innings in costume, right? Baseball. I mean, and yeah. the coaches are going to be in costume as well. I mean, how how does that work? Yeah. What, what's your what are you going as, Mark? Well, you know, it's a, it's either going to be a, you know, I'm I'm trying to choose between a country singer in uh, Kenny Chesney or uh, a gorilla suit. Um, so I haven't decided yet. And, <laughs> and um, yeah, coaches do dress out, and I, I will tell you this: is that every year the the costumes amongst the players is very secretive. So it, you know, we really don't know what's going to show up. Uh, but in the past, we've had uh, Teletubbies. We've had. Hooters girls, we've had Little Bo Peep, we've had a lot of different guys come out there in different costumes, and and uh, it's it's fun to watch because it's very challenging to play baseball in some of these uh, costumes, so um, <laughs> it's a lot of fun, that's why we shorten a game down to five innings, because, uh, you know, you can imagine going out there maybe in a penguin costume trying to pitch an inning in that so it'll be very interesting well mark again six o'clock tonight really appreciate it oh just quickly tony how's tony doing is he going to be there yeah he'll be here and, and he's doing great and uh, thank you for asking you know he's still you know on the road to recovery but he's doing great and then we're very you know happy to have him back every day and within their uh, inner workings of the program we're really happy to you know kind of have him on a day-to-day -day basis where you know the last couple of years has been challenging for him health-wise terrific mark appreciate it we're out of time but that is mark martinez assistant baseball coach got the halloween game tonight at tony gwynn stadium just a couple of seconds left chris gotta get to our tweet of the day <laughs>